Some say I'm too uptight, but I disagree. I wake up and live my dream. Someday soon, I'm gonna make it. Yeah, all hard work's gonna be worth it. So I'm doing the self cleaning of the washing machine right now that's what the noise is i started another habit you guys i know you're like what she folding clothes as they come out the dryer but uh yeah i have gotten into the habit of when they're finished when they're finished drying i go ahead and fold them right here and put them straight up so I'm super proud of myself. make my green drink this morning let me get some water i've shared this um on my vlog channel a million times but i do a a green drink i'll put a picture of it because it's in this container and not in the original packaging but i do a scoop of the green mix clean simple eats i do two capfuls of extra strength collagen this is made by Spoiled Child. I'll link everything I use in the bottom. I do two capfuls of organic apple cider vinegar. Make sure you use the one with mother. And I do a squeeze of lemon juice. I feel that doing the natural lemons is probably the best, but I don't have any natural lemons. And then I mix it and I'm gonna get a straw and drink it. And that's my daily green drink. It's the apple cider vinegar that gives it kind of a but it's not bad the flavor from the green drink and the flavor which i think that's mango the spoiled child extra strength collagen i think is mango it's either pineapple or mango i think it's mango apple cider vinegar is really good for you it helps with your skin it helps with your body inside your insides i'll put what apple cider vinegar does for you on the outside, but it does a lot. I have a whole book on all of the things that apple cider vinegar does. Oh, I was just checking. Oh yeah, y'all know I'm a Dunkin' Donuts girl, but when Walter was in the hospital, there was an actual Starbucks in the building on the first floor of the building that he was in. Girl, every day, every single day, sometimes twice a day, I had Starbucks. And so one gift card says I have $1.79 and the other gift card says I have $18.44, which I'm confused as to why my wallet, maybe is this, this particular one says it's empty, but this isn't what I came here for. I came here to say, girl, can y'all see that? Michael Kors, 255. 62. How is it that I got $255.62 on this gift card? I'm going to call and confirm that. And if it's true, we're going to Michael Kors tomorrow just for some empty out this gift card before I lose it type stuff. So I know I'm supposed to be cleaning, but this is an emergency. <laughs> Michael Kors check gift card balance. I don't want to send one. Okay. Enter gift card number. That's the gift card balance, enter pin, check balance. Oh, missed the number, folks. It says my balance is $10.59. <laughs> I knew something was wrong with that. I used this gift card. Okay, I'm gonna check one more time. <laughs> Cause I'm in denial, 6006-49. All right, and then the pin, bridges. $10.59. So I believe it just didn't update. I don't know why. Oh, I do have $8.84 on a Dunkin' um, card too. That's cool. I pull in
into your driveway, it's a Saturday night You look like a million bucks wearing that dress I like You're smiling but there's something missing in your eyes Girl, I can tell that you have something on your mind But I will make you forget all your sorrows Let go like there's no tomorrow morning y'all it is monday i slept good last night I, my husband barely moved he must have slept good too he didn't really toss and turn and stuff like that which he normally does um he doesn't really care for those mattresses and we do need new ones i'm thinking about getting that memory foam topper that everybody is talking about on timu but I'm going to have to read the reviews, see what they say. And if I get it, I'm just going to get one, and we can try it out. Your husband is a you ain't about ready? I'm just ironing my shirt, then I'll be ready. All I got to do is throw my clothes on. Everything else done. I'm just ironing my shirt, knocking the wrinkles out, and then I'll throw it on and I'm ready. Oh, lock the front door. Okay. Bring the trash out. Okay. That's all I need you to do right now. Okay. All right. All right. And the car won't Okay. All right. All right. So I had this big old to-do list, but my husband has put a wrench in it because he's got some things he needs to do and he figured we could go together. When we leave, he has to, when we leave, he has to stay in the laundry room, look at him peeping out. Looking like, you don't see me. You don't see me. <laughs> Let me put my clothes on, I'll be right back. I really um, am ready. I just need to, Knock the wrinkles out of my shirt. I washed my face already, but and brushed my teeth and all of that. But I hadn't. Ooh, that's fine. This is the watermelon berry serum by Green Bean. Everything you see me use in this video will be linked down in the description. So that's the serum. I'm doing this backwards, but it's okay. Cucumber hydration mist green bean and baka cho face cream also by green bean this is all i use on my face is green bean products that's it and it's been doing really well so normally when i'm in the shower i use a three-part i wash three times so i use dial soap that's the first layer i normally do that with a washcloth the second layer I use is wet, but this is an exfoliating washcloth. Really scrubs the skin. And today, with that, I use the 18 in 1 Hemp Peppermint Castile Soap. And then wet with my trusty loofah. Y'all see it's raggedy. Change them out once a month, y'all. They should get like that if you're using them right. <laughs> and I tried for the first time this raw sugar moisture loving body wash watermelon fresh mint is the scent 10 out of 10 do recommend let's go uh, I decided to come in Ingles I don't know why you're so dark I decided to come in Ingles and uh, get the flowers and I'm glad because they have a Starbucks in here thank you why it was so dark out there. Let's get some Starbucks. I wanted to check my gift card. I'm gonna get a venti caramel ribbon crunch. Yes. Can I, I got like a $1.79 on one of my gift cards. Can, can I do more than one so I can get rid of that one? Okay. Press what? Okay. Yes, please. Thank you. I always get the same thing, y'all, every time. I love caramel. I love frappuccinos. Same thing every time. I don't know what's off with the color, but I'm gonna have to fix it. 
check my computer. Thank you. You too. Never disappoint. This drink never disappoints. That is so good. Those roses are pretty, but I'm gonna go see what they have in bigger bouquets. See if I can find a rose that matches these. All right, we made it to Walmart. Got to go in here and get something for my husband. Uh, I probably need to get on my phone and Google it so I know what I'm getting. So, I'll be right back. Is it called Luca's or something like that? Yeah, it's in a bit. So, I'm on the same aisle as the, um, as the oil, but I don't think... No, it's it... on the other side. Okay. Okay. So it must be where the big one is at, because this one is twelve forty four. Okay, then go ahead and grab that one. Okay, I'll be there in a minute. All right. All right, bye. That was easy. I also called my friend and let her know that I was coming shortly um, with her Epsom salt. If you guys follow me on the vlog channel, then you see me take flowers to my friend that I told you had cancer. Well, she just recently went in the hospital and um, her cancer is too advanced and she's entering palliative care or hospice. So my goal is to keep her loaded with flowers because I want her to see them and enjoy them while she can. Alrighty, we made it back home, you guys. I need to get these uh, receipts out my pocket too. Go ahead and scan them. Are y'all doing your fetch rewards? And let's see how many points I got. First, I got to moisturize these, these crusty, dusty lips. I'm still working through these little Vaseline things I got from Timu. I love them. I got a bunch of junk on them. Too many phones. Okay. So I scanned the receipt. Everything I needed is um, highlighted. Store, date, and total. And then you just slide it up. And I got 25 points. I'm also eligible to tap for extra points, and today I got 10 extra points. So now I'm gonna hit snap another and do the next receipt. Same thing, all three are highlighted. So we slide it up, it's spinning around, 25 points. Come on, and good boy. So one of the things, and I did have a list this morning of stuff that I have to do so I can check that off. Um, I got the flowers from Sam's and the Epsom salt that my friend wanted. So I checked those two things off. I was gonna get a three ring binder and a three hole punch. I ended up getting those on Amazon. I printed these pages. I'm gonna make myself a folder for personal Bible study. So this is gonna be the front of the folder. You can't really tell it on camera. This is a real light pink and it's waves in the background and it says personal study notebook. It's like nine o'clock in the morning, but I'm gonna fix some leftovers from yesterday.
I changed my mind about leftovers. It's too early. So I scrambled me some eggs with cheese and some corned beef hash, my favorite breakfast. So I'm going to go ahead and fix breakfast, you guys, and I'll talk to y'all in a little bit. Happy Tuesday, y'all. Listen, I just thought I'd do a quick unboxing with you guys. We got a couple packages in the mail. I'm going to figure out open a review. I'm super excited about this one because I've been asking my husband for this one for a while. And um, I took advantage of Black Friday to get it on sale. We actually had one. I can't remember why we took it. Remember why we took it down? As long as it ain't now on the shower thing. What? Why we took it the up and down? Shower head. That ain't no shower head. I know it ain't. <laughs> he just playing, y'all. I asked him about it before I bought it. I'm so excited for the shower head. I love a shower head that you can take down and use as handheld. It helps with, with washing your hair, getting your back, all kind of stuff. So, I thought this one was really cute. To me, it looks like a butterfly. So, this is the rain shower part. And this is the handheld. And it actually slides in just like that so the sprays come from every direction and when you want to use this part you just lift it out real cute can y'all see it so cute i'm so excited so when we put it up i'll show you what it looks like this next item i normally you guys are going to marshall's with me to pick some up but i actually you know everything in the store has gone up so instead of paying 5.99 a bottle I caught the Black Friday sale on skinny whatever is it skinny Joe skinny syrups.com and bought a few for $3.99 so I got four flavors for my coffee these are coffee syrups they're sugar free so zero calories zero sugar and they flavor your coffee and this is what I always use and so the flavors I got this time was white chocolate pumpkin. I actually just finished one of those and it was good. I got maple donut. I got pumpkin caramel. And I got toasted marshmallow. So these are on SkinnySyrups.com for $3.99. And then this is the salted caramel sauce topping. It's like if you're going to make iced coffee and stuff like that. And the reason I got that is because... Whenever I go to Starbucks with Dunkin' Donuts, I always get the caramel something. Iced coffee or frozen drink. And I figure it, I can, we always make coffee and have at least half a pot left that I normally heat up and drink over the next couple of days. So I figured instead of going to buy iced coffee, I could use that coffee and make my own. And so I got the caramel flavor. And I think this was $2.99. But anyway, that's what I got from Skinny Syrups. Love it. Love it, love it, love it. And I got one more box. This last box was a dress that I had bought that was on sale. And I was thinking about wearing it this weekend. I think my friend's 50th. We have some friends that are celebrating their 50th wedding anniversary. And even though my husband may not be able to make it, I'll probably go. And I think I'm going to wear this dress because it's like kind of a black tie formal thing. And I figured a little black dress would be cute. I'm going to show you these items, but I guess I'm going to try them on and show you what they look like. And I don't want to do that right now, so I'll be back. You talk about slept good last night. I slept good last night, y'all. Video looks like that. Let me fix it. I don't know what's going on with my video, but listen, I slept good last night. Listen, I got a lot of stuff to do today. Um, I want to find somebody to take my hair out. I need to refill my medicine pack. We got a bunch of laundry. I got this hamper. Oh, y'all, this shower right here. I told y'all all you got to do is take this part down. Oh, that shower is beautiful. We got some settings back here. That's just the rain shower part. The rain shower and the handheld. And that's just the handheld part. And then 
and the handheld has a bunch of settings. So that was a good shower last night, y'all. And I'm going to take another one this morning. That was a good shower. So anyway, I also want to try on the clothes that I unboxed yesterday. So we got a lot to do. Let's get into it. took my shower and uh, started some laundry made my green drink and I need to take my medicine this is the last day I had already ready in my old pill pack this is the one I take on the road with me so I still need to do my pill pack but I got some errands to run y'all look over that because y'all know I'm going to get this taken out today Before I was pouring the apple cider vinegar in a cap, in the cap of the bottle, but today I actually measured two tablespoons and I can tell the difference. It's tolerable, but it's strong. Okay, so we got five items to try on. So. Let's get to it. Y'all want to see me try on some Ashley Stewart clothes? Keep watching. Okay, this is the first dress. It is, I think this is more of a summertime vibe. Not sure how comfortable I am with the fit. My friend Shanae said I'm buying my clothes too big, so I went down the size. These are 18. <laughs> okay, so this is more of a summertime vibe. I got it because it was on sale like 50 or 60% off for Black Friday, but I think it's cute. I love the feel of it. This is linen, you guys. Dress number two, you guys. Kind of snug on me. I would probably put a safety pin in it to do this. The arms are definitely snug. Um, and it's right at my knee. So I don't know. Definitely ought to lose about five or 10 pounds to feel comfortable in this. This is dress number three, you guys. Definitely need some shapewear with this. Love the cutouts. I got it because of the rhinestone cutouts. Thinking about wearing it this weekend. Definitely need some shapewear. I should have went up a size in this one. This is outfit number four. Way too tight. <laughs> I absolutely could have wore this this weekend. I may call the store and see if they have one in stock. I'll take it back and upper size because the leg length is perfect, but it is definitely too tight. Last but not least, this is the last sweater dress. I think it's cute, so cute. And I think it fits perfectly. Love the fit, love it. And this is a 1822, so everything just be fitting different. Let me uh, find a number for the closest Ashley Stewart. There's only like two in the area. And I think the closest one to me is like, so let's see. Open. So let's see if they have the jumpsuit in stock. Okay. 
It's a great morning at Joshua's Tour of Fayetteville where we have 40% off of all four price items. This is Keisha. How may I help you, please? Hey, Keisha. I was trying to see if you had in store. It's a black jumpsuit. It's like a cape. It has the cape arms. And it's a jumpsuit. A black all-in-one jumpsuit. So online, does it say online exclusive? I'm not looking online. Okay. It came in my order. I guess I could pull it up online real quick. That doesn't sound like anything that I've received yet, as of yet. I got the item um, number you need it. Let's see, hold on. Okay. Okay, go ahead. What's that number? It is 402-013-572-602. That was 402-013-572-602? I lost you. Let's see, 402 so it's 402-1357-2602? Yes. It says online exclusive. Oh, man. All right. I was trying to trade it up a size. I can wear 1820 in most items, but this is snug, and I want to wear it Saturday. Uh, it's probably because of um, the style of the material that it's made of. That's what I'm thinking. It's kind of our, not spandexy, but you know what I mean. It's probably that type of materials that doesn't give. Okay. So, yeah, we don't have that one in the store, love. Thank you so much. I appreciate appreciate it. All right, baby. All have right. a great one. You too. Mm -hmm. So, I was thinking about trying to do a quick ship, but they don't even have, they sold out of this. In the regular fit, the only thing they have is a 3436. No 1820s, no 2224s, even in the tall. They only have a size 10. So I'm going to keep it and I'm going to get into it, but not this weekend. I wonder how it would fit with my body magic. Got you sitting up on the dash so i'm sorry but good morning happy thursday i couldn't get my braids taken out yesterday the shop i ended up going to well first of all i got up ready for an early start and then my mom calls and says she's coming to my house at 12. so that kind of threw me off i went over to my girlfriend shelly house because she made chili and this drink called Sorrel. Oh my goodness, it is so good. If if I can get like the ingredients or something, I'll put them on the screen just so you'll have an idea of what it is. But that Sorrel was amazing. 
I have like this much left. So anyway, I called a braid shop in Lovejoy that I have been to before. And I feel bad because I always go to them to get them to take my hair down. But I never go to them to get them to do my hair. So she was like, um, did, did we do your braids? And I'm like, no. <laughs> Again, no. So I feel like she's charging me extra. She's charging me $60 to take my braids down. And I feel like it, it should be $50. But it's whatever because I don't have the patience to take all these braids out of my hair. So I made it back in from getting my hair taken down. My husband says my hair looks shorter. Um, like maybe they cut it. But I think it's because... See, the knots are still in it from the braids. So I've got to comb it out. I'm going to deep condition it. And all that jazz. Look how my hair is shedding. I'm going to deep condition it and all that jazz. But first, I want to get dinner on. So I'm going to make some fresh string beans and possibly a meatloaf with these hamburger patties I got. I know I'm supposed to be um, washing my hair right now, and I will in a minute, but my Amazon packages came. So I wanted to show you what I got these items for. I told, so we got a three hole punch. Now these are plastic. These are tabs for my binder and these are the plastic ones the heavy duty ones and I actually ordered some smaller ones too so this one is a binder I'm so excited for this and I'll show you why in a minute but I got purple which is my favorite color so I got a three wing ring binder and it has pockets this is a set of highlighters and I already have highlighters but they're like a pastel color and I want to be real intentional with the colors that I use and these colors are be um, I would be able to replace when I need to so these are the other tabs these are the Bible tabs that I ordered so these are the Bible tabs. I, you guys saw me order some of these before. I got it in a similar color, but they're from my Bible. These are going to be from my binder. And then last but not least, I needed a solution for my personal hygiene products in the shower because I was using the kind of shower caddy that goes over the... Um, shower head but it just won't work for the type of shower head that we have now so i'm not real optimistic because of the material that's in my shower if these will stick so if they don't i'm just gonna send them back but these fit in the corner like this and you have all these space and it comes with two so we'll try that out shortly I 
I love it. So this is what it looks like. This is my personal study workbook. And the first section is for when we study our public watchtower. There are my watchtower answers. I was going to put a three hole punch in the current watchtower. You can do it online, but I like paper copies. I study better for some reason when I have a paper copy. But I have a place to write out the answers that I'm gonna try to answer at the meeting. The next section is for our weekday meeting, which is a Christian life and ministry meeting. And there are two separate pages. This first page gives me space for thoughts from treasures from God's words, spiritual gems, apply yourself in the field ministry. And then the second section gives me the living as Christian section. This says pure worship is all we're in a different book, but I, it doesn't matter. I know what it is and then any additional notes. So I absolutely love it. The next section is for personal Bible study. So you can put here um, what chapter you're doing for personal study. And then you can answer these questions. What does this tell me about Jehovah God? How does this section of the scriptures contribute to the Bible's message? How can I apply this in my life? Talking about the what I'm reading and how can I use these verses to help others? This is perfect to help me to think about what I have read and meditate on it. So really good. And then Bible character study. You put the character's name there, when they were born, the place of birth, and when they died. This is who they were. So I can summarize who the Bible characters were. Qualities to imitate. So in this box, I'll put the scripture that identifies a quality that I would like to imitate. And I can briefly put something here. And then qualities about that Bible character that I can avoid. Again, you put the scriptures here. And then what is it that you're trying to avoid or imitate? And then what did they do? So I can summarize what they did. And I absolutely love it. Now, the reason I got these big plastic tabs is to separate each section and I can actually write on them. So I'm gonna write Watchtower, Christian Life and Ministry, etc. But then I got these smaller tabs because when I'm doing my personal Bible study, right, um, I can put the chapter on it that I'm studying. And then more than one page will go with that whole. So Genesis will have probably a page for each chapter that I study. However, when I'm going back and looking through this or wanting to re uh, review what I studied in the past, I can easily find it because I can get the Genesis or Mark or Matthew or Luke or um, Isaiah or Psalms really quickly because I have the tabs. Okay, you guys, it's kind of dark in here, but this is the first one. Like I said, it's a little bigger. Okay, I put the second one up here, and again, we could do maybe a bar of soap. This is my raggedy loofah that I gotta throw away, but I can do like a loofah, or I can throw, this is for my feet. This can go up here, because actually, there are these on either side, so I can do the loofah right there.
Mm. Mm. This is good. Mm. to show you my fingernail polish I got a manicure yesterday um, it looks can you see it's black and this one is gray so it's mood changing polish as you can see the tips are black um, but this hand was in the water more I'm washing my hair this is black and then this is gray and sometimes they're all black sometimes they're all gray it just really depends on the temperature once my hands come out of water, it'll probably um, cool off and be gray. But when it's a little warmer, it's been black. I thought that was super cool. Hey, y'all. I made it back home. This is dark. Can y'all see me? see me? I made it back home. I wanted to show you. It's dark in here. Is that better? Let's see. Wanted to show you my hair. Something real quick. It took her like an hour <clears throat> to do it. Okay. Nails are gray. Can you see that? Y'all know I wear them short. I wear my own nails now. I don't get acrylic. Nails are gray, right? So... Put them under the cold water now they're black that's what the mood the mood changing um polish i think they're so cute i love them i absolutely love them i might try more colors i love them so anyway that is a whole week's worth of video I already have like three hours worth of footage to go through to get this video together and I really want to bring you one vlog a week so we're gonna try that 
and I'm going to do it a little every day each week. So you can have a weekly vlog just to peep into my lifestyle. So if you like that idea, give me a thumbs up and a comment in the down in the comment section. And share this with a friend so we can grow you guys. I love bringing y'all videos on this channel. So help me keep um, growing so we can keep posting. Talk to you soon. Bye bye. Some say I'm too uptight, but I disagree. I wake up and